This is another case of a cable melting. The person had an RTX 5080 video card as well as a Corsair HX 1500i power supply, so quality gear. Now the cool thing about these MSI connectors, and this is a better picture of it right here, you can see all the smoldering that is happening on it. Oh boy, look at that. Remember, if you're enjoying the content, I usually produce a video every single day. You can throw a thanks back to me by doing what's above here. Like, share, subscribe, and comment, but don't, don't forget to hit that notification bell. Oh boy, look at that. However, the connector on the GPU itself does not look like it is damaged, which is pretty lucky. So all that was damaged was the end of the cable, which is um, which is good, which is good for him that it didn't, I, I don't think so, at least damage the video card itself. But here we go again. And by the way, if you have a problem with this, if you have this connector, and cable and you have, you know, the connector melted, the cable melted or, you know, whatever is happening, either it's on the power supply end, the video card end or the cable itself. You can go over to this Reddit post. It's an RTX 50 series 12 VH PWR mega thread. You can go over here and post your comments and insights and everything else that is in this thread. This is absolutely mega. There's no mistaking that. So yeah, here we go again with in this case, a very fancy MSI yellow-tipped power cable. And how this power cable works, it's just a cable, basically, right? But the yellow tip is supposed to help people seat it properly into the GPU connector. So the cable, when you push it in at the end, if you see yellow, bad, it's not seated. If you don't see yellow, that's good. But according to what I have seen so far, the person connected it correctly and it's still smoldered. Again, it's not really melted. It's just some smoldering going on here. Yeah. So expensive. You know, all this hardware cost this person thousands upon thousands of dollars and still this is happening. It is crazy. Now, some people, if you go through these Reddit posts, are saying it's user error and it's not the cable, it's not the connector, it's not a design flaw, even though there's massive amounts of voltage and stuff going through these individual pins. And they are, they are coming out with power supplies to actually regulate the power on this connector so you know there is there is a problem and there's people dreaming up special you know apparatuses with fuses on them to try and not really solve the problem but come up with a solution so it doesn't burn your i'm exaggerating now but burn your house down uh but yeah i mean this is this is bad isn't it this is this is really bad and i would rather see a bunch of eight pin old-fashioned eight pin connectors multiple eight pin connectors rather than this pretty looking single 12 vh pwr what are your thoughts